up with you again and now you're in a new role. Uh, what is your exact new position? Uh, I'm actually program director for uh, Microgrids. We have decided as a company that this is an area that we really want to focus on and explore and build on the um, existing business that we actually have in renewables and, and in, uh, in grids and, and all of that. And we also have solutions already on the microgrid side that um, we have been implementing. So we just decided that we want to take it to the next level because we believe this is a market which, uh, with tremendous growth opportunity around the world that also addresses some of the things that we were talking about today um, in terms of uh, decoupling economic growth from environmental impact, uh, etc. It's an area we really want to participate in. So, we were talking about tonight, it's a really exciting uh, segment of clean tech right now on microgrids. What, what really excites you the most about jumping into this, uh, going from solar, which is also exciting, but a little more mature or developed, you might, you might say. What's exciting about microgrids is that it's a market that doesn't really um, exist today per se. It exists only in a traditional form. And to be able to leverage uh, the know-how that we have, as I mentioned, uh, in renewables, but also in the grid system and power electronics, and really provide a solution that you can deploy to more places. You can address access to, electri to electricity. We're also going to address power security. Um, and, and as a whole, really bringing um, the technology in, in, to, to sort of a production level uh, where you can really deploy it faster, you can deploy it at, at higher volume and address the energy challenges that are uh, that we're facing today because it's not going to be everywhere where you're actually able to pull um, transmission line to address some of the energy demands that are required today. And leaving solar, well you're not really leaving it, but going from your your role at the head of solar. What are some of your strong reflections on the solar market as you transition? First of all, what a ride. <laughs> it's been incredible. It's been really uh, wonderful to be part of an industry where it's gone from immaturity to becoming more mature. It still has some ways to go, but nonetheless being part of that transformation and also uh, having joined ABB in the middle of all of this to really be able to make a difference in the uh, in the market with the focus that ABB decided to put in on, on solar. And I'm not, I'm not sure if you can say, but guesstimating, what percentage of ABB's focus right now is on like solar, microgrids, electric vehicles, and if you can say, you know, where do you think that would go in five to ten years? How much more of, the, of your company's focus do you think will be on those things? That's a difficult question to answer, uh, the sim but simply, we're focusing on all of them. We're doing all of this in parallel because, frankly, you need all of it. When you look down, you know, 10, 20, 30, 50 years for the next generations, you need the renewables. You need